acid reflux is associated with uh, the presence of Barrett's esophagus, but not all patients with Barrett's esophagus report symptoms of acid reflux, which is very important to consider. There is, in fact, something about the Barrett's lining which may make it more insensitive to the effects of acid reflux. And so many of my patients with Barrett's do not report a history of acid reflux symptoms, and this is important to consider. Or they may have had a history of symptoms years ago and they may have lost their symptoms over time. If you have a history of frequent or long-standing symptoms, that should probably warrant an evaluation, even if those symptoms may have gone away. In patients with cancer, some percentage do report a history of acid reflux symptoms, but not all do. You do want to be evaluated before um, you present with symptoms of difficulty swallowing or weight loss, which typically signifies a more advanced cancer. There's usually nothing we can do endoscopically at that point. That would be treated usually with surgery or chemotherapy and radiation therapy. 